Hi guys, welcome to my channel. This mama loves Disney. Okay, so I have not did a haul video in like forever, but I just wanted to share some of the stuff that I ended up picking up yesterday. I went to three different Hobby Lobbies for the cra craziest reason. One was to go get paint. The first time I went there, I bought the wrong paint. So me and my daughter ended up being on the other side of town. I found the paint at a different store and then she had bought some stickers and I had those stickers in my hand and she had her planner on her and she put them in her planner and I was like, oh my God, I gotta go back to the same one that's near us and get some more of those stickers. And of course, along the way, I found a bunch of stuff because of Miss Susan Tootsie Tucker. <laughs> Susan girl, you just had to wheel, reel me in. I had been avoiding the haul videos, but because um, I saw her dye video i ended up going to see if i could find some uh dyes that were on sale and in one of the the first store that we went to they didn't have any dyes on sale and so um i they were marking them down so i figured i'll come back later maybe um and so sure enough i ended up making it by there and they had the dyes on sale so are on clearance i should say okay so i happened to just go by that clearance area and I was so excited. I was looking for this last year and they were all sold out and sure enough they had one left of each of these and I was ecstatic. So I picked up this one color box um uh it's called Petal Point um ink pads and so I was so excited about that. They come out and that's awesome. And then I ended up picking up this color box one. And I have one of these that's about 20 years old. Because my cousin and uh, my cousin had a stamp party one time. And uh, and so, oh, I didn't even realize these are removable too. Oh my gosh, the ones that I have are not removable. So, like I said, I have one of these that's about 20 years old. Uh, my cousin had a stamp party and got me into stamping bags and butcher paper for presents and so uh yeah so I was excited to find one of these so I got picked up each of those and then um I ended up picking up some of these little key rings I thought these would be really cute to make uh key ring charms and then I needed these oh my god I needed these so bad so I had mentioned in Susan's video the video that I needed these little rings to attach um, a little umbrella to a bow and I did not have them and now I have them. Susan, I'm so sorry that I didn't attach it, but the this is the, the metals that I needed for that attachment. So now if I decide to do that again, I have them. Then I ended up finding some of this just, uh, Timmy Holtz Distress uh, Glaze. Um, I told Misty I wasn't sure how I was gonna use it, but um, yeah, I'll figure it out. Um, I found these letters, these little acry acrylic uh, alphabet letters, and I could not pass these up because um, I thought this was a great deal. And then I found one of these um, banner sets um, and this another one of those deals that I couldn't pass up and the letters are perfect to fit on there. So got those. Timmy also, or they had Timmy's uh, Distressed Oxide inks on clearance, and I don't have any of these large ones. I have a few of the, the small ones that uh, he has. So I ended up picking up two different shades of blue um, because I figured you can use them for the sky or you can use them for water. I thought that was awesome. And for the price of $1.49, couldn't pass those ones up. Absolutely great. Then I have... Um, uh, I don't know if this foil is going to work. This is the hot foil system, um, the Glimmers. Um, I have the heat pen, and I thought I would try this. So I figured for $3.74, I couldn't beat that. So I was excited about that. Then, Miss Tootsie Tucker. Oh my goodness, Susan, you had me buying dyes and I don't have a lot of flower dyes, so I thought this was perfect. It uh, uh, was $6.24 and it makes the 3D dyes, I mean 3D uh, flowers, I'm sorry. So I picked that one up. 
Then I picked up another Timmy Holtz one that has the wreath and a wreath and um, oh my gosh, uh, snowflake, and a great price. So I couldn't beat that. And then another one that Miss Susan Tootsie Tucker had shared. I don't know if Susan picked this one up. She probably did. But um, also picked this one up um, because I do not have um, an embossed scallop um, dies. And then this one with the Christmas tree I thought would be perfect um, to use the large one for to share your embellishments on as a background. And plus the tree, um, the trees are pretty, okay? Then, I'm not really a happy planner girl, but um, they had the happy planner stuff that was notepads, because I already have a planner. So I picked up the small little notepad. I already took all the paper off and everything, or uh, the plastic off, but um, these are just little notebooks, and I thought it would be cute to put like a mermaid stamp, uh, sticker on there. And these are just uh, clear pages. I mean, not clear, but blank pages. So I thought this would be perfect to put in my car. And then they had the medium sized ones that are just notebook uh, pages. And it says, be your own kind of beautiful. And I actually had a few years back um, uh, a planner that was a happy planner that was similar to this. So I do like this. And then um, on each of these uh, file pages, sorry. Each of these file pages, there's a cute little picture on them. And that also has the dotted pages for the notepads. So these are all, you know, just some pretty pictures that are inside here, pretty images. And it's just a notepad. And I thought that is great because I do need notepads all the time to write my crafty ideas or take notes from videos that I watch. And then I love this cover with all these different ladies, these beautiful different ladies and different sizes, I love that. And then of course it has kind of similar, sorry, similar pictures in here for the covers. And again, it has the dotted uh, pages for notes. That's cute with the puppy dog. I love her little shirt, it's cute. Um, and then there's another one. And there's the same image. But yeah, these are just perfect. Look at the paper. So these are just notepads. So I thought those were really cute. And that, so that's a large one. That's a large, okay? Then they had these little stickers. They had all kinds of different stickers. They, I think they had Boss, they had uh, Pastel, and then there was another one. I forget what the other one was. And then they had uh, Holiday Seasons. So these are just little um, stickies to put inside of your, I guess, um, Happy Planner. But I don't have the Happy Planner, but um, I thought I can use these for anything. I'm not worried about it. I just thought they were cute stickers. So I went ahead and picked those up for $1.49. And then on my this year's calendar, because I usually buy, I'm looking at it right now, the pocket calendar. Um, I bought some new pens and I was all excited to use the new pens. And I wrote everybody's birthday on there and all the different anniversaries and stuff that I usually do on my calendar. And for whatever reason, the ink started bleeding. So I went ahead and uh, picked up this little sticker set because I thought, you know, what I could do with this is I can go ahead and uh, cover the pages, or not pages, but I can color, cover the squares with these. Um, I won't open it because it's kind of hard to get it off. But I figured I could just cut them to whatever size I need them, you know, and then just go ahead and uh, put those in there. Or I can use them for anything else. But these were the stickers I had to go back and get. So my daughter had picked up some of these. She had her platter with her in the car, and then she put it in her book. And I thought, oh my gosh, those are so cute. These are the holiday ones. So I picked up two sets. So I can use one for this year and one for next year. And then I picked up these beautiful, it was a three-piece set. I took them apart. I thought, because my car is blue, <laughs> I would keep two of them in my car um, for just, you know, the little odds and ends that I always keep in my car. Cause I usually keep a nail file in my car. I keep, a, um, some band-aids. I keep, um, some, I always keep, 
um, safety pins, a pen or a pencil, just little odds and ends. And I could just keep it in my car. And then this one right here, the little one, I can keep change. Um, I have a little area for change in my car, but um, I thought, you know, when there's times that I end up with more change than I want, so I can put that in there. And then this particular one doesn't have as much blue, so I'm going to keep this in my purse with my pens. So, yeah, so those are all the little goodies that I picked up at Hobby Lobby. And then um, I will do another video uh, right after this sharing some paper that I picked up at Tuesday morning. Um, I was only supposed to go to Tuesday morning. I've only been going for boxes. Um, but this last time I stopped by because I received some cute, cute um, sequins from Miss Susan Tootsie Tucker. Boy, girl, you got me shopping. <laughs> but um, I received some really cute sequins from her that had Mickey Mouse heads. So I went to go look to see if I could find some more. And uh, I ended up coming home with a couple things. So I'll share with you on the next video what I picked up. Okay, you guys, have a great day, and I'll see you on the next video. Bye, guys.